Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. To replace the front wheel adjuster assembly on this GE refrigerator, you will need a Phillips head screwdriver, a 3 8 inch nut driver, and a ratchet with a T20 Torx bit and quarter inch socket. Before you begin the procedure, unplug the appliance's power cord. For better access, detach the toe kick plate by using the Phillips head screwdriver to unthread the two mounting screws. With the screws unthreaded, pull the plate free. Have an assistant help to lift up the appropriate side of the refrigerator and support it. Use the ratchet and T20 Torx bit to unthread the two screws securing the hinge cam. With the screws unthreaded, set the hinge cam aside. Using the 3 8 inch nut driver, unthread the front wheel adjusting bolt from the adjuster assembly's speed nut. Now use the ratchet with a quarter inch socket to unthread the three screws securing the front wheel adjuster assembly. With the screws unthreaded, you can set the old adjuster assembly aside. To prepare the new front wheel adjuster assembly for installation, slide the speed nut into place in the assembly. Now transfer the cardboard spacer from the old assembly to the new one. Next. Thread the front wheel adjusting bolt part way into the speed nut. Fully align the adjuster assembly on the frame and thread the screws to secure. With the assembly installed, reinsert the hinge cam guide pins into the holes in the bottom of the door, then thread and tighten the two screws to secure the cam. Remove the support and lower the side of the appliance. If you need to level the refrigerator, rotate the adjusting bolt clockwise to lower the new wheel or counterclockwise to raise the wheel. With the refrigerator leveled, realign the toe kick plate on the lower frame and thread the two mounting screws to secure. Plug the appliance's power cord back in, and the refrigerator should be ready for use.